What is up guys and welcome back to Milk Made of the Milky Way. Ooh, in the last video we had made it onto the spaceship and we are taking a tour with Amrita and she showed us a part of the spaceship where our cows are and there was a bunch of milk beasts, alien beasts um, there and she was basically saying that they're almost extinct because the last male died a long time ago, I think. Milk beasts, they were called and they were grand. Its eyes was, its eye was the size of the back of my hand. Oh yes, I wanted to make it a bit softer. It is really loud. Put it back there. I let out a huge breath of relief. They hadn't ended up as ground beef. Yeah, thank goodness. This is Pal, our expert on bovine. He says your cows are divine. Thanks. His voice was old, I must admit. These are beautiful. A perfect fit. A perfect fit, you say? For what? If I may. Yeah, for what? For the sacrifice, of course, he said without remorse. What? What sacrifice? Tell me now and no lies. Girl, please stop your crying. You see our breed is slowly dying. Through vision blurred, I heard. Only your cows can save our herd. My heart sank like a stone. You kill my cows to save your own? Not kill per se, but a sacrifice must be made. I'm sorry to say. What does the sacrifice comprise? And why does it lead to my cow's demise? I understand what I'm saying is bold. We transfer youth from the old, oh, from the young to the old. Okay, wait. You're gonna make my cows really old? To believe it must be seen. Let me show you the age machine. Her voice was proud. She said, "Ruth, this is the machine that regains lost youth." Yeah, I need that machine in my life. Your cows will save our holy herd when we have their age transferred why do you need my cows for this it felt like being swallowed by an abyss a trade must be made for aging to reserve these are the laws of the universe matter for matter they must be the same age is the ember but youth is a flame Ooh, are there multiple endings Refuse bargain. I don't want her to take my cow's youth. I'm going to refuse. You can't make me. I can choose. I won't let you. I refuse. And Marita tilted her head and smiled. You act like you have a say in this child. I'm taking my cows. I'm leaving the ship. I said with a stiff upper lip. The young believe they hold the power. But time... Will grind your bones to flour. Look how sassy she is. My knees went weak and I could not speak. I just added an and there. Walk, whispered a voice. I followed it without a choice. No! No! Oh my gosh, don't worry, Ruth. I'll only take your youth. What the F? I think I should have bargained. Bones being skin cold, heart pounding, my mind appalled. <clears throat> oh no! <laughs> I think I chose the wrong thing. <laughs> oh! 
I'm old. I'm cold. I'm happy to see you up and awake. I'm sure you're confused. Your body must ache. The man seemed understanding. I didn't have to explain that every part of my body was in excruciating pain. Why is my body different? I asked in dismay. And why has my blonde hair turned so grey? Your youth was stolen by our queen when she put you in the age machine. His shocking words cut me like a knife. With the poof I was at the end of my life. But what can I do? Can it be reversed? Can I get young again or am I cursed? I'd love to help you but I have no years to spare. The ship is filled with elders as far as I am aware. I'm aware. Now please excuse me, I have lots of work to do. The feast is soon upon us and I would hide if I were you. Why? Are you going to eat me? Can we go this way? Wait, can we go the other way as well? Oh, we can. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's go this way first. The woman looked like a great grandparent, just skin and bones, almost transparent. Were all these elders here at rest a result of Emerita's youth obsessed quest? Once his people had probably been agile, now they look close to death, so fragile. Um, the sleeping person looked old and frail, breath so heavy, skin so pale. Okay. What is this? Oh, I'm going somewhere. It looked like the rising beam of light could reverse gravity, but just not quite. I probably have to fix it. It was hard on my body to kneel, but I picked up a bolt made of steel. Okay. <clears throat> a glowing metal will shine so great under the stuck bent metal plate. Can we... But I needed tools, not just my hands. Okay, so we need to go look for tools. I hadn't been here long, but I guess it meant that something was wrong. So we need to fix this thing. Okay, we can't go any further that direction, so let's go back. Can I push this button, actually? <laughs> oh, I can. <clears throat> Push the button. Hmm, everything seems to be in order here. I have to go back to my brewing beer. Okay, so this button calls this gentleman. And he's making beer. This extra bed, uh, hopefully that is not for me. <coughs> it was an unfamiliar appliance meant for some strange science. Oh, I picked up the empty jar. Now where was the nearest bar? Oh, that's funny. Let's just pick up shit. Please don't touch that drink. It's not ready, I think. Okay, okay. Let's go. Let's go this way. Greet sewing age machine. Greet. I asked the lady who was sewing. Hello there, how is it going? Hello dear, I'm awfully occupied. Her face looked puffy, like she'd been she'd recently cried. I am Ruth the milkmaid, I said. I am Anissa. I work with needle and thread. Sewing. The sewing looked terribly painstaking. What may I ask are you making? Oh my stars, I'm going to be sick. This cape is make I'm making is far too thick. And Rita demands a flowing cape. But my fabrics are heavy and won't hold its shape. I can't make this cloth fly like silk in time before the feast of the milk. Okay, some kind of event that's going to happen. 
Do you know a way to get young again? Maybe I could trade years with some younger men. The seamstress went quiet, her sewing slow. She muttered, I'm sorry, I wouldn't know. Oh, boy. I swear I saw a boy back there. I don't know what you mean now. I'll have to finish this for the queen. Okay. What's this cape you're making? Anissa's hands were shaking. The queen has explicitly expressed that this cape shall leave everyone impressed. If the cape won't drape tenderly over the queen, she surely will put me in the age machine. But my fabrics are heavy as leather. The cape must be light as a feather. Goodbye. Okay, so... Hello, boy. Um, this is Halim, the last boy on board. He must be hidden until order is restored. Oh, he's young! <laughs> if Amrita finds out, all hope is lost. We must keep him a secret at all costs. When I grow up, I'll change the rules. I won't let the queen treat us like fools. Halim, my boy, your time will come, but now I need you to keep mum. Now quick, go hide, and Nisa cried. <clears throat> I want your youth! I want to steal your youth. I wonder if I could put, could have picked up something there. <clears throat> What are these? A crate probably used for freight. Okay. I gave it a stare. There was nothing. There was nothing there. It was a revolving spool spinning like a whirlpool. Okay. And I I had tried to ask myself, but I had nothing to put on that shelf. Something stupid? I had tried. Okay. Oh, hello. <clears throat> Can I see what this is? A burning flame with no sense of gravity was floating mid air in the huge round cavity. Okay. I can't go downstairs. Um, no. Oh, maybe down the ramp. Because I'm old. I'm old! Yes, I can go down the ramp. Oh, tools! He looked up and said with, with certain snide, to use the dimensional focuser you need to be qualified. I was hoping I could just take your shit. Hey there, let me set you straight. No one touches my void crate. I want to take your stuff. It looked like some kind of blueprint, symbol so tiny I had to squint. No, no, no. I want to look at it. Oh, here's that thing that we just came from. Okay. Okay. Hey, lady, hold still. No one touches my power drill. Okay, let's speak to this gentleman. Greet. Hello there, miss. I'm the mechanic of this. You look new. Have I seen you before? And what did you come down here for? I explained my dire situation. Vis shook his head for the whole duration. How can she demand our support when all she does is extort? If I wasn't this old, I'd disobey my power tools would sure make way. Okay, so she's make, she's keeping everyone old so she can control them. What are you repairing? I asked and looked at strange thing. This is a hover sled, an old design. We use it 
<clears throat> we used it to herd our bovine, but there's been problems with the steering. It has a tendency to suddenly start veering. And of course, no one here can ride the sled. We're too old and soon we'll all be dead. Am I going to make friends with the boy? Do you need help to fix it? I can aid you. Just have to teach me the tools of the trade. There's not much you can do to help, I think, unless you get me something cool to drink. Oh! Okay, so we will get him a beer. A beer! Can I take your shit now? No. <laughs> I can't walk around this way. <clears throat> okay. Um, okay, let's go back. Oh, I know what we need to do. Okay, cool. I know what we need to do. We need to distract the man with the bell and then go steal his beer. And then give this gentleman the beer. This. No! Uh, sorry. I'm so old. Look how slow I'm walking. She sped up there. I could take the glass, yes, but that would create a big wet mess. Okay. No, quickly. Ah. So I need to put the glass down first, I think. Oh no! Walk away quickly! Okay good, he didn't come yell at me. <laughs> Hopefully, it is just beer we're giving this man, and we're not giving him poison or something that's really bad for him. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh my god, glitch much. Oh my gosh, is it just me or her boobs huge? And she's walking, it's just like swinging all over the place. Here's your beer, sir. You are a kind woman, you're the first who's come down here to quench my thirst. Yeah, what does this mean now? Are you gonna teach me? Is that it? Repairing. What are you repairing? I asked and looked at the strange thing. Um. Wait, I gave him the drink, right? Okay, so maybe I can just take his stuff from now. Hmm. No. So we got him this beer. And... Now he won't help us. He's like, whatever. 
Alright guys, I think that's going to be it for this video. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed and I'll catch you in the next one. Cheers.